okay. So this is the truth. This is the nature, the essence, the power and presence of the one, the whole. And I am its living embodiment, its divine direct manifestation through the uniqueness that I am. I am here to bring forth the kingdom gifts of creativity, of imagination, of compassion, of generosity of spirit, of that which bespeaks everything I assign and ascribe to the nature of the divine, all powerful, all knowing, all generous, all giving, all understanding of the way the laws of life are truly specialized through the law of my own being so that the words that I speak from my soul through the role that I play in everyday living becomes a seamless manifestation of the invisible showing up as the visible, the intangible showing up tangibly, and the absolute unconditioned presence and power of God showing up relatively through the people, the places, the things, the experiences that I am privileged and honored to have internally first and then externally. So I give thanks today for yet another ongoing reminder that life is lived, mine and all others, from the inside out. I go forward from this moment examining my own willingness to take a new commitment, to step into a higher inner calling that draws me to serve, to support, to assist, to give of myself in new magnificent ways that provide more fulfillment to me than to anyone really. So I experiment. I let my whole life be that marvelous experiment of seeing what it feels like, what it thinks like, and what manifests as I dedicate myself fully and completely to living and practicing the presence of God. I accept this as the absolute only one whole truth that reveals itself in its oneness as all. So I am the whole. In the oneness I know myself to be, I know peace, I know harmony, I know reconciliation, I know great wisdom in the minds, hearts, and lives of all people, here, there, and everywhere, known and unknown. For this is the universal way it really is. And so together, in acceptance, in gratitude, and great joy, let us all declare, and so it is.